Today, we'll learn about the signs indicating a malfunctioning crankshaft position sensor, CKP. So, if you suspect your car's CKP sensor might be causing issues, you're in the right place. Let's get started. To begin, let's understand the role of the crankshaft position sensor, CKP, first. Its primary function is to monitor the rotations per minute and the precise position of the crankshaft within the engine. It's important as it enables the engine control module, ECM, to manage the timing of ignition and fuel injection. To locate it, while the exact location varies depending on the engine model, the CKP sensor is typically located on the lower side, either at the back or front of the engine. Now, let's look at the symptoms one by one, starting with number one, no start. When the ECM can't figure out how fast, RPMs, or where the crankshaft is moving because of a failing crankshaft sensor, it's like trying to drive blindfolded. So without accurate information from the CKP sensor, the ECM cannot command the appropriate spark or fuel delivery for combustion to occur, which leads to the inability to start the engine. This is why the CKP sensor is important in the combustion process. So if you suspect a faulty CKP sensor is causing starting issues in your car, a mechanic should diagnose and replace it. Attempting to start the engine repeatedly without addressing the problem can only lead to further damage. Have your car towed to an auto repair shop where they can perform a diagnostic test to confirm the issue and then replace the faulty sensor if necessary. Number two, stalling. Stalling can happen when the CKP sensor fails because it's responsible for providing important data about the position and speed of the crankshaft to the ECM. The ECM relies on this information to accurately time the fuel injection and ignition spark. So when the CKP sensor malfunctions or fails, it can lead to an accurate timing of these processes. As a result, the engine may receive incorrect amounts of fuel or spark at the wrong times causing it to stall unexpectedly. This symptom is particularly noticeable during driving when the engine's demand for precise timing is highest and any disruption can result in stalling or even complete engine cutout. If you're experiencing stalling due to a faulty CKP sensor, address the issue immediately to avoid potential safety hazards and further damage to your car. Start by having the CKP sensor inspected and replaced by a mechanic. Don't delay in seeking professional assistance to ensure that you're safe on the road. Number three, engine light. If your car's engine light is on, a quick and cost-effective way to diagnose the issue is by visiting any auto repair shops, retailers, offering free diagnostic scans to help identify issues with your car. If the scan shows a PO335 code, it likely indicates a problem with the sensor. This code specifically points to a malfunction in the crankshaft position sensor and suggests that it may need attention or replacement. Once you have that code, you can research it to understand what it means for your car. Depending on the severity of the issue and your comfort level with car repairs, you can decide whether to address the problem yourself or seek assistance from a mechanic. But it's always advisable to take immediate action when this happens so you can prevent further damage to your car. Number four, rough idle. Let's say you're parked with the engine running and you notice your car shaking or vibrating. This happens because the ECM is struggling to get the timing right for sparking the fuel in the cylinders. Since the engine's rhythm is off, it is causing the shaky vibrations in your. Without any accurate signals, the ECM can't do its job properly, which can lead to rough idling. So. If you notice your car shaking when it's parked and running, it could be a sign that the CKP sensor needs attention. If you experience rough idling where your parked car shakes, it's a good idea to have it checked by a mechanic. Ignoring the issue could only lead to further complications or damage to your vehicle. Number five, acceleration issues. When you step on the gas and your car speeds up, it's a dance between your engine and the road. But if the CKP sensor fails to accurately measure engine rotations, it disturbs the critical timing coordination. That's why you might notice your car doesn't run smoothly when you accelerate. So, without accurate data from the CKP sensor, 
the ECM can't adjust the spark and fuel timing properly for acceleration. So if you're experiencing issues when you try to speed up, it could be a sign that the CKP sensor needs attention. It's also advisable to have your vehicle inspected by a mechanic to get proper engine operation, especially during acceleration. Number six, lower gas mileage. The reason your gas mileage takes a hit when the CKP sensor goes bad is that it mixes up the ECM's ability to get the right data. Think of it like the ECM is trying to cook a recipe, but it's missing a key ingredient. Without accurate data from the CKP sensor about how the engine's running, the ECM can't adjust the fuel injectors properly. So, you end up burning more gas than you should for the engine's needs, and that means lower gas mileage. So if you're noticing lower gas mileage in your car, it's wise to have it inspected by a mechanic, especially if you suspect a faulty CKP sensor. When you continue to ignore lower gas mileage, it could lead to increased fuel costs and potential engine issues down the line. There you have it, the six common symptoms of a faulty CKP sensor. I hope this list serves as a helpful guide for identifying and addressing any issues you may encounter. Your car's CKP sensor has a very important role for your car, so ensure it's well-maintained. If you're experiencing any of these symptoms, don't hesitate to take action and have your CKP sensor inspected and, if necessary, replaced by a mechanic. Taking care of your CKP sensor can keep your vehicle running smoothly and efficiently. If you find videos like this helpful, make sure to like and subscribe so we can assist you. Fix it!